But we, you know, we made it work, and and, and and now we're here. So we're thrilled. And now we're here. So we're thrilled. My name is Harry. I'm the Meghan Markle here. Okay, today is September 7th, 2023. It is 3.13 a.m. I've already did my recording. Let me show you my list now that I have a better recording device. I've recorded all of these already. Okay, this is for my other channel. This is for this channel. And this is bonus. I just add these. And I saw something and I wanted to share it with you. While it's quiet, it's right now it's 3.14 a.m. Now you guys could see this portion of my screen, okay? 3.14 a.m. So I want to capture the moment while it's quiet, record it, and I'll put it out, edit it when I have the chance, okay? So what is going on? Um, this is my last recording that I did that was a test, and I just finished editing it because it was good. The sound was good. Everything was good. I could improve on the sound, but it's much better than what I've had before where I went into some issues. So I'm going to leave it and I made it a video on its own. So now I want to share this with you. Um, okay, so there's two things. This is the one, this tweet, I'm going to make it last, but it's the one that made me want to uh, do this video. But I'm going to make it last. And I added two other tweets along on that particular list, that bonus list. I only have three. Okay. Oh, let's go on this. All right. So I'm telling you, squad or tweeting every day, every moment. Okay. So this is extra. That's not the main reason why I wanted to do this bonus video. Okay, ma'am. I didn't use the word princess anywhere on my tweet, yet that's the first thing that popped into your head. Thus, you clearly know Megan is a princess, and uh, it's what bothers you. Okay, so she retweeted that. Someone saying she's not a princess, she gave up that title. Okay, so let's see, where did this come from originally? Okay, it came from this. This is something she tweeted, and I m did I mention it on my previous recording? I don't think so. Let's see here. The UK royal family, no, Meghan Markle out, royal them all without trying, and did mannerism, connection to people, intelligence, and charm. They need not worry. They will not be able to access and abuse her again. Her elegant curtsy here, like Liz herself, was likely her last bow out to them. Okay, so that was during the um, Queen's funeral, and this is her uh, curtsying. Oh, I made a big deal out of this. Okay, go to, is it on this channel? No, Pure YTE. Because she was wearing a heel, her posture, the way she bent down. I mean, I went off on that. Okay, so that was the main tweet and she responded to her tweet. You're all right, Princess Megan is magnificent. England's loss is our gain. Okay. So this woman here, this person, I don't know, it could be anybody. She's not a princess. She gave up her title. She's still married to Harry. Harry is a prince. As a result, she princess. Over the weekend, they were hanging out, having fun at Beyonce's concert, touching and dancing and all of that. They're still married. So she is a princess. Uh, what is it? Is it that Lady L who got divorced since 1970 something to whatever person who was able to give her the title and she kept her title okay even though they divorced so I'm just saying okay but Megan is still married to Prince Harry she is a princess and she is a Duchess of Sussex okay so there's this here uh, Duchess of Sussex, Princess Henry of Wales, Countess of Dunbarton, Baroness of Kinkale. Because this is all of Harry's title. Okay? These are all of Harry's title. 
in connection to being married to Harry, she is also all of that. Okay? All right, let's see here. There's one coming. Duchess, Princess, Countess, Baroness, nothing. Okay. So what are the other ones then? So why focus on her only? Okay. After I finish this, I'm going to black her because this is something I do not want to see. Megan is my princess and a girl marries a prince and she is not a princess. Shoe Jen. Okay. Uh, he's never going to have sex with you. <laughs> okay. He's never going to have sex with you. Just let you know. All right, no, she didn't actually, although I think they tried, they tried to, and we're told they stuck with them. However, both of them are okay either way. It's people, it's people want to use the title or not, they don't care. Harry has always told people to just call him Harry, and Megan is the same. That is true. When she's still married to a prince, pretty sure that still makes her a princess since parliament hasn't stripped harry's title just yet we can expect the status quo to remain indefinitely he did agree to stop using his hrh okay his royal highness but still entitled to it all uh, right she remains a princess of the united kingdom she is duchess of sussex but she is also hrh princess henry all right so it's just people making noise out of nothing where it is i did say i'm gonna let's black while i'm at it done with her black people refuse common sense okay let's go back Ooh, let's put the thing back again to see this the squad's tweet under hers. So this was the main one here. Okay, her legal name is now Princess Henry of Wales. What are they not getting? Got to love when the hit dogs holler. There it is. Okay, poor dear. She's only got one follower. Oh, it's probably one of those bats. There, I blocked her anyway. Yes, Princess Megan. Even if, let's say here, you know how people in the U.S. usually say their husband is the king of the castle and the wife. I mean, we don't go around and call it, but when we're making joke or making reference, this is the king of the castle, uh, the queen of the castle, because you take care of the home. home. Even in the U.S., we could easily say Harry is the king of his castle. Okay? We could say whatever we want. This is the thing they're not getting. And this is what piss many of these people off when they see, um, you know, the tr I don't want to go to political thing here with the Trump side of things. Okay, yes, Princess Megan, that bat has had one follower for eons, just blacked her, Princess Megan. All right, so let's go to the other tweet. All right, so is that one? Let's see here. Now you guys could see everything that I'm doing there's this here okay same uh squatty who's responding to the haters and this is gonna be black as well okay yet where are you dave stalking my tweet on megan moko when i don't follow you your followers or have shit in common with you creeping undercover fan you are all right so she retweeted that why did the social climber marry into uk royal then but who cares it's great news we won't have to see them again all right, so let me go into that and then I'll come back out. There's my comment here. Let's see here. Where did it start? It started here. Okay, I don't know who needs to hear this, but Megan Marco can never be compelled to curtsy to, oh, same comments, same tweet again, uh, compelled to curtsy to Kate Middleton of Prince William. That's a fantasy, y'all, Kate. Rangers, the Rangers need to let go. Besides, Megan is American. We don't bend the knee to Brits. Okay? The Duchess of Sussex will not want to return to the UK and the future and face cut seeing to the Princess of Wales or royal biographer has suggested Andrew Morton who collaborate with Diana. Princess of Wales on his 1992 book Diana, her true story, rolled out a move back from the US for Meghan and the Duke of Sussex. Alright, so there's this here. Okay, why did the social climber? All right, they're calling Megan social climber when Megan is the richest woman who ever married into the royal family. Okay, self made millionaire. Let's see, and not my king couldn't even afford her. He wanted her to keep working while interfering in her job. She paid for her stuff and Harry as well. I'm not gonna read this. All right, I'll put it just in case you guys didn't see it. Um, that's the book Spare. You could pause and read it. 
Okay, I bet she feels the same way. May she never set foot on that salty, toxic island again. Okay, I am glad you are never going to post anything about her ever again. All right, Dave. By the looks of it, Kate is not going anywhere. She has her eyes on the prize, not her dignity. Mm -hmm. Charles couldn't even afford to buy her food. What was there to climb over? <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> That's a good one. Charles couldn't even afford to buy her food. What was there to climb over? The classless warriors are the pinnacle in your society. Sorry, they're just a mediocre group of people sucking up the pu public tit for their survival. Okay, social climbing is uh, chasing a man for 10 years and allow humor use you in all kinds of ways while cheating non-stop and breaking up, then end up sleeping or dating your boyfriend's friend to make him jealous, also copying all of his ex to get him to notice you. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, she has a much better social life in the US than she ever did in the UK. Also, you're lying, but you already know that. Okay, what a loser you are. Pray for less male chauvinists like you on this earth. Okay, you bow to the royal stalker and of 10 years, the social climber who's talking the heir of the royal family, the heir of the royal family, moving from one uni to the next, she can write a book about stalking a prince. Okay, Dave is a racist stalker like the rest of them. Okay, you obviously don't think anyone could love poor Harry in spite of his monstrous, monstrous family, and that's just sad. It says, it says, it says much about you. None of it is good. Uh, okay, I was gonna say after this, that's it. Okay, are you t are you talking about Wadey Katie, whose self-made millionaires have defrauded investors, the public purse, and bullion had to pay for their house. Otherwise, they would probably be in the street. Uh, you know the one who go to royal weddings in Jordan when they're not royal. Yeah. Okay. Uh, talking about uh, her family, uh, who went to the royal family. Because okay. I think I covered that. I think what happened, there's issues between the two, uh, between the two Wellses. So to keep peace on the plane, they bring the, the, the mom. And then the disrespect William did uh, while uh, at the wedding. The wife is walking behind and all of that. So they had to bring her to show respect for the other one. But at the same time, they were showing all sort of uh, nasty behavior. All right, so let's black this while I'm at it. All right, let's go back. All right, so I'm back. This is my comment here. Okay. The answer to his question is because poor royal chased her ass. Okay, Harry. That's Harry. Okay, moment he saw her, he had to up his game. And I was beautifully surprised when I when I walked into that room and saw her, and there she was sitting there. I was like, okay, well, I'm going to have to up, up my game. <laughs> And saw her and there she was sitting there I was like okay well I'm gonna really have to up, up my game <laughs> and sit down and have a and make sure I've got a good chat he chased her all the white women in the UK were more interesting grand price the crown the spare become valuable until the black American saw diamond and a rough all of a sudden they want him Okay, Megan is the wealthiest woman married into the royal family. The royal family wanted to make that big wedding. By the way, they need to return her dress she paid for. Okay, today is a mutual black day, so I'm going to black him. Dave and the rest of them are such a creeper. Ew, the male derangers are even uglier than the females. <laughs> All right, so that's that. And one of the things the squad are doing right now while Invictus is going on, we will not be talking about the salty island all right so this is the tweet that got me to start recording again because i've already recorded an hour plus all right so i saw this i'm gonna share it with you if you don't see any of his videos on my videos if they flag it i'm just gonna take them down okay i, I have no big deal out of it i just want you in on some of the things that he is uh, uh sharing okay if he decided he wanted to be down Guess what? I'm more than happy to take them down. All right, so there's Matt here. I call him a new squaddy. Okay, I hope you're sitting down. T, okay, T Fog, I got time today. Classless Crusader, Prince Harry, Meghan Markle. So, 
let's go on his TikTok. I have it open. I started listening to it. Okay, I'm going to read some of his TikTok uh, comments here as well. This is the, ooh, where is it? It's three minutes. All right, I hope you guys. Okay, it's three minutes and 26 seconds. This is him. All right, he is such a joker, but on this one, he is uh, serious. All right, let's listen. All right, I hope you guys are ready for some tea because it's hot. I wasn't going to address this and I didn't want to give it light, but you know what? Let's do it. I'm going to start off by saying the UK girl, evil. The media is evil. If literally the little bit that I've seen in regards to how they get treated and like it's only been a little bit for me. So let's start off with Kinsey Gate. In 2015, I won a contest for singing on Instagram to attend the iHeart Awards for free. We had all access. At the time, she was a red carpet reporter for the show. So I got to meet her. She was really nice. She was really sweet. And we took a photo. Yeah, it was at the iHeart Awards. Like, Okay, it seems like there's a person in the UK who have used some of the content, his videos that I've shared with you. And believe me, there were much more because I record them. They didn't come out good because of that uh, debacle that I went through. I didn't bother fixing it. Okay, so there were a lot of videos he showed during the concert with Harry, Meghan, dancing and all of that. So someone in the UK have used it and he knows how the UK is when it comes to Meghan. They were trashing Meghan by after using his video. So he wanted that to be taken down. That's my understanding of it. Okay, I wish I had those videos. I don't want to record them again. Usually when I do them once, I'm done. Okay, so let's continue so that's what he's making reference to i'm moving it back slightly <laughs> i had to look at my recording device to see if it's still recording all right let's continue she was really nice she was really sweet and we took a photo yeah it was at the iheart awards like there is a literal video i'll literally loop it right now i think music is a gift to the world got a post on instagram and i was like there's no way like i just freaked yeah. out Did I have a good time? Yes, that is how I know her. We have remained friends on Instagram. That is it. We have not hung out since that day. Uh, hanging out on social media, look how I share some of those tweets with you guys on about Twitter, okay? We talk, I usually talk about uh, with the squads over there. Do we ever meet? Do we know each other personally? No, so make that perspective, okay? switch the brain over to see where he's coming from you're not really 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 friend okay when you are really really friend it's almost like megan with abigail okay they meet they hang out they call each other the talking to people on social media doesn't really make you close friends I, i'm pretty sure if you go and hang out with some of the people you talk on social media most likely you're probably not gonna have that much of the same kind of attitude that you have on social media. The vibe, the personalities, face to face is not the same. Okay? So take that into consideration. Again, I'm moving it back. Friends on Instagram. That is it. We have not hung out since that day. And another thing, I did not give her the exclusive and I found out from everybody else. I had no fucking clue that she took my video. I did not give the permission and I've already submitted a claim to YouTube to take that down. And on another... So this is the other thing too. If he make a claim to YouTube about any of the videos that I use of him, I did ask, but I don't get the response. So if he decided to block any of the videos that I share with you, guess what? It's going down. I don't care. Okay, at least you get a chance to see them, but let's continue. But technically, I'm commenting on his videos right now. No, I didn't know how right wing the show she had moved to was. All I know is that she used to like Meghan and Harry and we used to chit chat about it online to each other. That is it. That is the extent of the friendship. Nothing else. And on top of that, I thought it was nothing at first. I let it roll over my shoulder. I'm like, was that fucked up that she went on TV and said we were friends on a right wing show? Like, I am completely opposite. If you look at the videos that I'm posting, it's clear we do not have the same opinion. As for covering my tracks, I know what's on my fucking page. That yeah, the thing is that the UK, they give them a little amount of money, they forget their dignity. 
I've been saying it from the time I started recording and sharing some of those tweets with you. And I realized the little they give them, they could do so much damage. It is so a shame to see how many people give their dignity up for so little. Okay, so this guy have principle. I like him. Even if he asked to take his videos down, I like him. Okay, but let's continue. Again, I'm moving it back again. Sorry about that. Those that I'm posting, it's clear we do not have the same opinion. As for covering my tracks, I know what's on my fucking page. That photo is still there. I went to the iHeart Awards. I won a contest. I loved that day. I kept it up. The reach that the UK is doing right now to try and spin this as if I didn't pay for my own seats mm -hmm. and I'm best friends with the right wing media. Like none of this makes sense. As for the box seats, I have receipts and here they are. Yeah. And they're trying to spin it as if like, oh, I'm just going so hard for them. First off, I'm brown. I know what it's like to deal with racism. I also have married a Brit, so. So this is the thing that brings the squads together because we understand the nonsense that Megan was dealing with. Okay, like I've said, I'm not ashamed to say it. I was not following Megan at all, at all. But I knew of her existence the same way I know a little bit about, you know, different, you know, celebrities here and there. But once you start seeing the hate that was going on, it makes you open your eyes and say, let me look a little bit deeper. What the hell is going on? Okay. So this is what brings the Sussex squad together. Megan was experiencing too much of a hate for no absolutely zero zero reason so i understand him and this aspect as well i'm so hard for them first off i'm brown i know what it's like to deal with racism i also have married a brit so i have those same fears that i was going to deal with racism hmm. luckily i didn't my husband's family is amazing loving supportive like I love them to death. And the claims that I'm a lower level social media person trying to just get attention. First of all, you want the attention. Y'all are all up in my fucking DMs trying to buy the rights to the videos, which I've sold to no one. <laughs> make it make sense. So in short, did I tell Kinsey or give Kinsey permission to post that video? No. That's the reverse psychology they try to do with people. Okay. They do the reach. And then once people start pushing back, they reverse it, pretending is the person who's doing it. They're good at that. They're good at that. And I'm glad he's keeping his principle and fighting back. Okay, so let's continue. Do I know Kinsey? Yes. Do I agree with what Kinsey says? Do I agree with her views? No. Do I think that she took the opportunity to try and use the situation to paint a picture a certain way? 100%. But at the end of the day, you're going to believe whatever you want to believe. So that's just the facts. Come on. This isn't my first time at the rodeo. I've gone viral several times. It's not a big deal, but Jesus, it's a big deal when the UK media is involved. Hmm. That is All true. Right. And the things that, you know, with the social media, you know, the thing that the, the Welses take uh, as a big deal, how many views they it's just unbelievable when they have the bigger price to think about and they're worrying about little numbers how many views and this and that it's a shame it's a shame so let's read some of the comment under TikTok. okay i'm really not on TikTok. i was surprised to see that i was able to play it you see the um, upload lagging i'm not even lagging in and i'm able to see it okay this is why we go hard for Harry and Meghan. Glad people are finally waking up to how deranged the UK media is. Okay, 1 billion percent happy that you and your husband had a blast at the Beyonce concert. Thank you for sharing video of people in love having fun. Thank you for all the videos. More like uh, acquaintances than a friendship. Honey, don't pay them no attention. Sometimes they, you, sometime you have to fight fire, fire with fire. And sometimes you have to fight fire with water, depending on the circumstances. Okay, D like uh, the lawsuit that Megan did. Okay, the copyright for them um, 
printing her letter without her permission and all of that, the copyright thing. Okay, that's fight, fight fire with fire. And then she put the water at bla on, onto the blaze. But they're still coming back. They're still, how do they call it, the residual of the fire. And uh, right now, this is where she just ignored them because they don't matter to her anymore. Okay, honey, don't pay them no attention. Get them all the way together. Thank you for your video and for speaking up. Off topic, your ticket were priced so good, so jealous of that. Enjoy your video, Harry and Megan. Okay, enjoy your videos of Harry and Megan. You are be a beautiful person. Tell them, okay, stay strong, Matt. You are our hero. I'm living, okay, I'm living for the team. You know what he reminds me of? He reminds me of uh, Buzzy because Buzzy, um, the derangers start attacking him. I forgot what it was. I must have it in one of my videos on PYTE. And then it's through that they attack Boozy and then Boozy start uncovering who they are. Okay? And then the chain of event, the small group who's doing this and doing that. And this is why they don't like Boozy. They keep on saying negative thing about Boozy. Okay? But they call Boozy to court. Boozy, what is it? I think they drop um, the case or whatever. Again, I did share it. I wasn't even aware the thing went to court or anything like that when I came across it. And I technically, whatever I share with you, that's what I know. Okay. If I had known what leading up to the lawsuit and calling Boozy to court, I would have shared that with you. And I was as surprised as I was in the video when I was recording it to share it with you. I was like, oh, what's going on? It, there was this black YouTuber who was talking about, uh, I think it was Boozy who shared. Uh, he's talking hard in his video. He's going to uh, sue Boozy, wait until he go to court. He's not going to settle. And Boozy just went and prove himself. And then I think the case was dropped. And I don't know what happened. If he was going to bring it back. And I think there were some issues that he could fix. He could bring it back. But he never did. Okay, thank you for your videos. Get them together, Matt. Wow, pay them no mind. Thank you for all the videos. Okay, so let's go back to Twitter. Okay, so this is where it was. And let's read some of the comments. I'm sorry you had to deal with the toxic British media. They're truly awful, but I've no doubt you can handle them. All right, thank you, Matt. You destroyed a narrative and became an icon all in one. The British media is toxic and deranged. Hang in there, Matt. And uh, it's like as we keep on moving forward, they keep on proving Harry right. Okay, when Harry did not, since Harry was young, he never want to deal with them. Okay, Harry had to go hang out and um, was it in Africa to get away from them. And he even said he doesn't like uh, hang being in the UK because of the toxicity that the tabloid, you know, is in in his country. And there he is, he left the UK, moved with his family, and they're still after him. I mean, my goodness. Okay, hang in there, Matt. Uh, that Kenzie used your video and spun a story that f that feign closeness isn't surprising because she is clearly a bit off <laughs> the school. Okay, off school and unethical. Always interesting how this type can go from like to hate she even photoshopped herself onto megan's engagement photo ah uh, so she's the same person disturb okay my goodness okay they want those videos so they can make money and break them down piece by piece you destroyed their whole narrative that harry was coming back and had no and was not happy what can they do now it is over you destroyed them in one night bravo <laughs> Uh, well done, Matt. You clear the air. The British media are mad that you deny them access to your video because they've had so many people who easily give so much for so little. Okay? You could think of many of them that I've shared on, the, on my videos who have done that except him. He's holding on. Okay? They're going to try to... They're going to try to keep looking for dirt on you and try to bring you down. But you know what? Just show them this. Okay. Um, don't respond to the taxi British media. You give them life. Everyone knows they're a huge joke around the world. Dear Matt, I believe you. Keep your heads up and thanks again for spreading the truth. As Megan and her friends sign off, love wins. Okay. Keep up the good work. Hang in there. 
Stay strong, UK Media is a sick business model. I'm so sorry to hear you are going through this with them. Okay, these people aren't ready for you. Can you now imagine what it's been like for your royal Beyonce neighbors? They've had this shit every day for years. Best wishes to you and your hubby. Okay, thank you. So you have go through this. Sorry, you have to go through this mess. Hopefully, all this noise and attention from the UK medias will minimize soon. They are a bunch of bullies. Stay strong. Okay, uh, you destroy their narrative and expose them. That's why they are angry. All right. So that's it. and then the other thing is that he's not letting it go. He doesn't want them to use his content. All right. So that's that. And I've recorded already. Um, I need to cont I need to do some good luck to all. Okay, so I need to do some more editing. All right, so that's it. Thank you for your support, and uh, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And uh, that's it. It is a great privilege to be with all of you today. You know, we want we ask for forgiveness and uh, and please come back. decisions that I ever made. You will be continually amazed how life changes for the better.